and scrapping <laughs> Hey, welcome back to our Super Rex Machine. It's of Corbin. I'm sorry. And you call us on it's Instagram and Twitter. Oh, juicy gong. It's so juicy. Wow, that's what that was? Yes. To be part of the notifications going on. Uh, oh, oh man. man. Did you enjoy that? Did you enjoy yeah. that? That was so good. That's huh? so juicy. Mm. I'm Today, gonna to, I'm gonna have to go back and watch that and see if there was any semblance of that because I don't uh, know yeah, there was. Really, it was yeah. spot on, Dollar Mindy. Not really. I'm basically the second coming of Dollar Mindy. I'm not uh, saying a word. <laughs> Read this. <sighs> not a swatum and tavil performance at temple. Not a swatum and tavil are called as mangala vatyam, which literally means auspicious instruments. These instruments are still played in temples and weddings in the southern part of India, especially in Tamil Nadu. These instruments are part of ancient instruments. There's reference to these instruments in epic literary works of Tamil dating back to 400 BC. This is also one of the dying arts of Tamil Nadu, but slowly gearing its historic relevance. The talented and amazing musicians K.P. Kumaran and P.S. Balamurajan are Sri Lankan Tamil musicians who are now spreading the art back into Tamil Nadu from Sri Lanka. It's quite inspirational to see how they made it to this place amidst all the civil war and unrest in Sri Lanka. Hope you enjoy it. Nadaswaram is an instrument that is specifically designed for outdoor concerts so that it can reach villages far and beyond during olden days. Oh, cool. The music can be jarring when, plays in, in, when played in a closed auditorium if it's played with same intensity. Hence, the musicians play it mellowed in a closed space. So it's supposed to be loud enough so like... Like, uh, right, I guess. tribes over can, like, hear it? I guess so. That's crazy. I'm, I'm intrigued, to say the least. Are you perplexed? No, intrigued. Uh, uh, are you, um... Flummoxed? Flummoxed? No, that's not a word. It is. What? If you're flummoxed... To flum? No. <laughs> if you're flummoxed, you are, uh, gassy. Here we go. I've heard that instrument before. Yeah, we've heard this instrument many times. Very animated. It's 
like a jazz concert. reference by which I can even begin to understand that. It, I think it was definitely the instrument. Remember that uh, we directed the thing a better week. I don't know if it made it on the channel if it was just on Patreon or not. But um, the one that was like the, and they were in town with a dude and they were celebrating folk music and folk dance with the women that were dancing mm, all wonderful. Yeah, 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 yeah. There was a guy, it was like a minute and a half song. He was playing, Probably. I think he was playing one of them. Well, and we've heard some of those instruments, at least I'm pretty sure they were in some musical scores to some of the films. Mm -hmm. But uh, it looks like it's a reed instrument, but that's all I could, uh, what flabbergasts me, and maybe it's like a rog, uh, what flabbergasts me is this is memorized. They're not looking at music. Yeah. And they're in sync, both the rhythm and that instrument. Uh, I just don't have a frame of reference for that musicality. It's just, it's so... That was wonderful. Um, yeah, that See, was that was incredible. What they were, what they were, both the, the I forgive me for not knowing the proper name for it, but the drum that the two were playing, and then yeah. the, and I don't know it said in the, the description, but I don't, I, I don't think I can no, say. No, it's but. just, it's one of those things that I just look at and marvel and recognize. <laughs> Sincerely, it's like seeing a new... This happens all the time on like a David Attenborough thing where you see a new creature underwater mm -hmm. and you're just like, okay, I know it's an underwater creature, but I have no frame of reference and I, I can't believe I've lived this long and never seen this animal and I'm amazed by the creative design. That's yeah, what I feel and, watching. And, that's like, uh, um, we've heard lots of instruments. I mean, you know, I'm pretty sure we've heard that one, but it's yeah. one of my favorites just to hear. It's a, it's, <clears throat> it's sharp kind of like a, like a um, it's like it's like a pipe. Yeah, it's like any of the instrument, and it may be this instrument or it's one similar that we hear, which are like the call to battle to battle. Yeah, yeah. I don't know if that's like Tamil Dudu's call to battle or the other one. You know, you hear it at like the beginning of songs mm -hmm. uh, when they're like I think Budge Mal Ramasani, Mal Hari's has yeah, it, yeah. has it, uh, and stuff like that. But it's a wonderful instrument. And then those guys that were playing the drum, I don't. It sounds like they're almost hitting metal. I know. Maybe they are. I was trying. <laughs> Like I could actually do it, I felt so stupid. There, <laughs> this is not a three-dimensional image, but I caught myself trying to look around <laughs> so I could What's see going? inside What's the drum. What does that mean? Yeah, <laughs> stupid reactions for a reason. Uh, I wonder if I, if I get a better angle, I'll be able to see inside it. Well, that was fantastic. That was great. Well, let us know what other uh, songs and uh, classic music 
videos which react to <gasps> up above. <gasps> you freaked him out. <laughs> <laughs> Tuh, mana cowok?